Hey y'all, this is just a quick how-to video on submitting your miles. The first thing you want to do is go to runsignup.com and sign in. Once you get signed in, you want to go to your profile, and then you want to go down to a section called Upcoming Events. You want to locate the event, and then you want to go off to the right-hand side and hit Submit Results. Once you get to this page, all you have to do is type in how many miles you do for the day. So I did six miles this morning. It's June the 1st. If you want to type in a comment, you can. This is optional. If you do type in comments, I would recommend typing in how you felt, how long it took you, and what the activity consisted of. And then all you have to do is hit Submit Activity. Now if you want to go in and you want to update your mileage on a weekly basis, you can. Just make sure that you change the dates accordingly and then you type in the miles that you did for that date. So if it's June the 2nd and I did 5 miles, just make sure that the date says June 2nd and then that you type in 5. And then if you have any comments that you want to type in, you can. Now if you need to edit your activities, you want to go down to a section all the way at the bottom that's called Manage Activities. You want to click on that. If you need to edit, it's on the left. If you need to delete, it's on the right. Now if you want to see how you're doing, you want to go to the results section. This is my individual race page. So as you can tell, I've done six out of the 375 miles. So I am 1.6 of the way done. And then if you want to look down below, you will see a live map. This is just a visual kind of giving you an end goal, but it lets you see where you would be at if you're actually doing this live. You can take this little guy and drop them there and it gives you a really nice look looking visual of where you would actually be at. Again, just use this as a way to stay motivated to hit that end goal. Um, and then if you want to see how you're doing with everybody else, you just want to go to the results tab and then you just want to make sure that you're clicking on whichever challenge that you want to be viewing. So right now I'm on the 375 challenge, but if you want to see how people are doing at the 100 mile 125 or 150 just make sure that that is highlighted at the top again just a quick little how-to if you have any questions or need anything just feel free to reach out and we'll get to you as soon as we can thank you all